Husband gets revenge against his anti-vax sister. My husband found out the other day from his sister, A. Note is an anti-vaxxer that several of his siblings had presented their parents with a memorial plaque for their anniversary. My husband was never asked to contribute, which is unusual for this group typically everyone is asked to pass the hat. He asked her how much the plaque cost and said that he wanted to contribute to it after the fact. This is when A started getting cagey, dodging the question and finally telling my husband to pay it forward. He said that that's for drive throughs and how much did it cost? Again she refused to say, then finally told him to pay her $25 $30. He said no, he would determine what his share was after knowing the final amount. Again she refused to answer, insisting that he should pay her $25 $30 to pay it forward. I contacted another in-law of mine, who is married to my husband's brother, and told her the situation. She asked her husband and found out that A had nothing to do with the plaque and hadn't spent any money on it at all. Another sibling, S, had bought the plaque without any outside contribution. So basically, A had seized the opportunity to try to grift off my husband. In response, my husband made a donation in A's name to a pro-vaccine charity and sent her a text to let her know exactly how he'd paid it forward. She's now also signed up for multiple vaccine charity mailing lists. And that's how you pay it forward, my friends. Well done. I read Memorial Plaque as Memorial Plague. Post her donation on social media. Hopefully it will go viral. He he excellent. I have a very homophobic cousin, so I donate to our local P-Flag organization in her name every year. She gets literature all the time about LGBT causes. I can put on a very innocent face when I want to. Didn't she initially refuse HHS contribution? How is that grifting? Other than stealing the honor of the gift. IDK it sounds like at first she just didn't want him to know she didn't contribute to it. She first tried to just avoid the topic altogether according to you. She only resorted to what sounds like a possible reasonable number as a last-ditch effort to avoid him finding out she didn't contribute, not saying it's great that she didn't put money into it, but it sounds like the grifting was not the primary intent when the topic came up. She obviously isn't doing the right thing here either way but just saying. Wow what a badass you really showed them. To be fair, A didn't ask Arp's husband for money initially, he pressed her. What she should have done was say S had arranged it but she didn't seize an opportunity to grift him, he kept pressing and for whatever reason she gave in and gave him a number instead of telling him to talk to S. This is stupid. Everyone in this story is an asshole. Cringe. Seems like the type of family you see on those daytime talk shows. Your husband is a petty king and I salute him. Cannot find any petty revenge here. Esh. Those Thanksgiving family get-togethers gotta be awkward, but I just wanna be a fly on the wall. Not really revenge. How is this revenge? Can y'all just come up with fake names instead of doing this letter bullshit LMAO? Cool story bro. This isn't petty revenge. You sure you two weren't just still triggered by her being anti-vax? WTH do vaccinations have to do with a plaque? I'm begging people to use fake names instead of single letters in their stories. Petty revenge I pressed an issue too far, got upset wasted my money spending it to get a leaflet letter posted through my sister's door that she threw away where's the revenge in this one. How petty, you really showed her, what a sad family. Until they hit unsubscribe. This whole thread gets an award fabulous. That's definitely petty. A I mean what was there to avenge? You guys sound pushy honestly. But good on further alienating your husband's sister? Not that they're great company. But you also don't sound like good company. Shrug light skin tone emoji modifier hashtag hash. Excellent this made my heart happy.
frame the invoice for the donation and send it to her as well. The only petty issues here are not being honest about S paying for everything, and you and your husband associating that A eventually telling you $25 to get you to back off of the subject as grifting. Like had A come right out with a dollar amount, sure, obviously that's not kosher. But you poked and prodded, not the other way around. Really feels like you went out of your way with this because you and your husband obviously don't like her not saying you should or shouldn't like her, that's up to you. Petty-minded is labeling unvaccinated as anti-vax. No surprise his but hurt feelings led him to continue his pettiness. Revenge, sounds like a real Nazi in the making taking revenge on someone who has differing opinions, but typical of a liberal. Liberals are dangerous. I may need those charity links. I know some people. So basically, being an insufferable asshole runs in the family. More so in the males. I love it face with tears of joy. That is actually pretty good comeback. My sister was anti-vax too. She's dead now. Wow, you sure got her. You donated your own money to a cause you believe in. S sounds like the only one in the family with their head screwed on tight. All of my trashy relatives also are the thieving and anti-vax type shrug hashtag hash it's a D type personality. D for dumbass. This is lame unamused face. A still didn't take the poison. So she wins in the end. We'd post an op and her family doesn't come out of this as the good guys. So basically, A had seized the opportunity to try to grift off my husband. Well no, she didn't. A repeatedly refused to take money from him and only caved under pressure saying to pay it forward. Op. I would be more concerned about why your own husband has been cut off from by his siblings, and not told about an important milestone in their parents' life or even asked to contribute. Very strange post indeed. What charities? I need some petty revenge myself. Brav fucking o. Oh. This is obviously made up. Well played. What has her anti-vax status have to do with the plaque? $25 is nothing. Let it go and enjoy life. This good petty. Tuche. Why couldn't your husband just talk to one of his other siblings? Why'd you'll have to go through back channels to find stuff out? LOL that big liar, she had it coming and that is so funny d. Touché I really like the way your husband thinks rolling on the floor laughing. You sound vaccinated. LOL. Well done 1010. Ha. Brilliant. Brilliant. I'm so sorry that your husband's sister got her head stuck so far up her own bum that her brain died. HAAA HARRA Touché. That's petty AF. Good job. Trophy. So thoughtful nicely done. Petty and I like it. Your husband seems like a real asshole. Anyone who willingly goes out of their way to make someone else miserable is, you shouldn't support this kind of behavior OP. Yeah that happened. Next time you might wanna throw in racist and homophobic along with anti-vax for more upvotes. Dang did his sister marry into 45's family? How sad his sister thought $25 was worth her relationship with your husband. How is donating money to a charity revenge? Liberals are insane. Sounds like a stupid way of trying to get his sister annoyed when she never asked for funds and he insisted and she appeased him and gave him a number that seemed fair and inexpensive. Brilliant face with tears of joy. Your definition of petty and mine aren't the same. This is hilarious. The post isn't against anti-vaxxers, but just giving background as to why the petty prank was done in such a way. Op could literally be an anti-vaxxer too. It wouldn't matter. <laughs>